What's up, YouTube? This is Josh Blackburn with Intense Fitness. Check out the website, intense-fitness.net, for all of your supplement needs. Remember, orders $95 ship free with coupon code FREESHIP95. Today, I want to do a video about uh, rest periods or how long should you rest in between sets. Uh, you know, it, it's going to come down to your fitness level and what your goals are, what you're trying to achieve. <clears throat> if you're new to training and you're trying to work on like your uh, your muscle endurance and your muscle stabilization, you're going to want to take you know about zero to ninety seconds in between sets. So you know, I mean, if you're doing um, you know dumbbell bench, you want to just take a break. You know, go get your drink of water. You know, for uh, zero to ninety seconds, and then go go back and you know do your next set, and then finish your workout. Um, if you're going for muscle growth, hypertrophy, rest period there is going to be zero to sixty seconds. So depending on what you're doing, um, you know, of course, if you're doing supersets, uh, you know, in between your supersets, you might want to take a little bit more time. Um, you know to catch your breath or you know to get to get everything going uh, but if you're going for now maximal strength <clears throat> you're gonna want to take a lot longer rest period because uh, you know you're exerting so much energy and force to move the heavy loads of weight you want to take the longer rest period so your muscles can recoup and so you can uh, your ATP levels um, and PC levels will you know replenish and so you can have you know the energy to uh, move move the heavy weight against. <clears throat> Excuse me. So then you're going to want to rest about three to five minutes if strength is your main goal. And uh, same thing goes for power. If you're um, you're training for power, uh, same thing. You're going to want to want want to rest three to five minutes in between sets to uh, give your body time to recover. Let get your muscles up ready and um, get your ATP and PC built up to go and smash some more weights. And uh, just real quick, um, if you rest, you know, if you take a 20 to 30 second rest, your ATP and PC levels will replenish about 50%. If you take a 40 second rest, that will replenish 75%. If you take a 60 second rest, there'll be 85 to 90 percent. So, you know, at a minute, you're going to be pretty much, you know, your muscles are pretty much going to be replenished with your ATP and your PC levels. But uh, from three minutes and on, you're going to you're going to be back to 100 percent, which you know will be your maximal strength in your power training. So I hope this video was helpful, and I hope it can help you continue on with your progress to make some gains and uh, reach your fitness goals. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and uh, let me know if you have any questions, and stay tuned for more videos. Thanks for watching.